Hello everyone, thank you for tuning in. My name is David A. Kwa and welcome to my YouTube channel. This is my weekly Sunday vlog for March 3rd, 2019. We're in March already! Oh my gosh, this year's going by quick. A couple more months and, you know, school's out and stuff, you know what I'm saying? Um, this is my weekly Sunday vlog. I'm going to tell you guys about what's been going on for the past week, what movies have I seen, video games I've been playing. I have a haul of DVDs to show you guys. We're going to do a Q&A towards the end of the video. I'm going to answer some of the questions that people asked me in last week's vlog. I'm going to answer in this week's vlog. So I'm just going to open up my, my phone, go to the comment section of the, of the uh, last week's vlog. I'm just going to answer like four or five questions, okay? And, and that, that should be a good vlog right there. Um, one video game I finished this past week. And I loved it, by the way. Far Cry New Dawn. You can get this game right now for $40. It's not a $60 release game, okay? If you want, go to my YouTube channel. There's a seven hour long video of my, my gameplay playing all the story missions of the game. Yes, the story missions, you can beat it in like seven or eight hours, okay? But uh, you have to do all the side missions too to be able to like level up your weapons and stuff like that to be able to beat the final boss. So uh, I would say probably like 10, 10 hours to, to, to beat the game. All right, ish. Um, I, I enjoyed the game. I like the story. I like all the different types. Of, like freeing the outposts, you can actually free the outposts infinite amount of times. Like when, once you're free a post, uh, an outpost, you can actually replay it again and stuff like that. I've been doing that like crazy, man. I got like I unlocked every single perk in, in the game. I, I I found all the the guns for hire, so I have every single person on my roster, so I can hire them to help me with missions and stuff like that. And I leveled them up too. I got like by the end of the game, I got like. Um, 70% of the trophies. It's like 40 some trophies like and there's still so much more to do in the game, too There's so much more side missions. You can go like hunting for elite animals and whatever like there's a I, I killed one elite animal. It's like a gigantic buffalo. He had like red eyes and stuff like that pretty 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 cool game um, You can also uh, loot more things around the game um, you can actually have these expeditions, you can do co-op expeditions, but you need to play by, by, by yourself also. I've actually done like two expeditions so far, it's like seven I think in all, because um, there's a trophy for beating seven missions or whatever. Um, I like the story, it actually wraps up Far Cry 5, so if you thought Far Cry 5 was a, 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 a unsatisfying ending, this one will, will, will wrap up the story for you guys, okay? The father returns, and you have, you see his little drama story and whatever, you know, and, and the story wraps up very well. I, I love the game, you know. Um, also, during my video on YouTube, okay, just go to the description of the video, you can jump to a specific part of, the, of my gameplay uh, by looking at the, the little scene selection, the timestamps in the description, okay? So you say, I want to see David uh, uh, fight this boss, or, or I want to see David try to beat this mission, or do this treasure hunt, or, you know, or try to solve this puzzle or whatever. Um, that's in the video, so just go to the, go to the description, okay, and like... Gosh darn this! Hello? Okay. Okay. Bye. Some people have asked me to do a montage video of all the times my parents called me during the middle of a video. I think I should actually do it. Like, if you guys can actually like find out all the videos that where my parents call me right in the middle of a vlog or something, uh, and during gameplay, like when I'm playing games or whatever, uh, <laughs> I may actually put all together for you guys. So yeah, Far Cry uh, New Dawn, I really enjoyed the game. If you haven't played it already, do check it out. And the other game I played this past week, I wouldn't say I've I, I beaten it, because it's like you can play it a bunch of times, you know? I played a few times every single night before I go to bed. The price is right. I played like one round and, uh, you know, I got like $5,000 throughout the entire week and stuff. Uh, I really enjoyed this game too, okay? Uh, I like Price is Right. I watched two movies this past week, um, and they have a little theme going on here. I watched The Young Messiah and Joseph and Mary. I've had these movies in my possession for like 
Three years. I never watched them. Like, I bought them when I was, like, back in the apartment. Remember that? When I was living by myself? Um, and I just never saw these movies. And I was like, one day, I was like, you know what? Let's just watch these movies. We got Easter coming up and stuff like that. Why not, you know? So, The Young Messiah is about the story of Jesus when he was, like, seven years old. He was, like, discovering that he's, like, the Messiah and stuff like that. So, he, he ran into, you know, this blind rabbi. He was talking to some, some, um some uh, 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 priest or, or whatever, like in, in, a, in, a, in a synagogue or whatever. He was talking to them and showing all his wisdom and stuff like that. And then uh, he was like, wait, that baby that was born in Bethlehem had the, that the three wise men came. Like, what happened to that kid and stuff like that? Wait a sec, am I that kid? You know, so like, so there's like him like discovering that he, he's like, the, like the, the son of God and stuff like that, okay? And the other movie I saw this past week was Joseph... Uh, and Mary, it has um, Hercules, <laughs> and it has um, uh, uh, the lady that played uh, Freddie Lowndes in the Hannibal TV series. So she played Mary, okay? And the story was like, you know how um, when, when Joseph was, well, not Joseph, when Jesus was born, like King Harry was like, uh, oh, I don't want this kid to grow up and take over the kingdom and stuff like that, you know? So kill all the, all, all, all the newborn babies and stuff like that. But, uh, you know, Jesus and Mary and Joseph uh, got out of there. Well, there was another family that they're like friends with who, you know, King Herod and his soldiers like killed the baby. Uh, he killed their baby, right? And you know, so, so he went on this kind of revenge tale. So the entire movie was basically like Joseph and Mary getting their friends to, um, to like not kill the, the the soldiers and stuff like that. Like there was a big revenge story with uh, with, with that. Okay, so th that's basically the, the there's more stuff that happens in the movie, but that's that's the main point I I got out of it. Okay, um, I bought two DVDs. I got out of Goodwill. Okay, so for like two bucks each, I got Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer. This is a um, uh, a movie I saw when I was a little kid, and uh, it's nice to have a DVD here of it. You know, I, I, I had it on VHS when I was young, but uh, finally had to see it again. I saw clips and bits of it on TV, you know, every single year. But uh, yeah, uh, now I should have uh, Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer on, on DVD, okay? Uh, maybe in December or closer to Christmas, I'll do like a Christmas movie collection with Rudolph and, you know, Peanuts Christmas and... And, you know, Miracle on 34th Street and Jingle All the Way and all those other Christmas movies all together, okay? The other DVD I got is wrestling related, but it's not WWE. It's TNA Wrestling, The Knockouts, The, the Ladies of TNA Wrestling. Mm-hmm. I watched a little bit of it. There's only one match on this. There's only one match on this DVD. And it's between Gail Kim and Tracy. If you don't watch, um... Uh, TNA or Impact Wrestling. Um, I know Gail Kim was in WWE at one point, but she was uh, she wasn't used a lot. You know, she she was in a lot of matches. Um, and the rest of the DVD is like um, interviews, photo galleries, photo shoots, and stuff like that. There's only one match on here. Okay. Um, okay. Let's do the Q and A. I picked out like. Five questions, okay? So, number one here, Five Nights at Freddy's versus Jaws. Are you gonna play Devil May Cry 5? I'm, gl I'm glad you asked this question, because I actually did play the demo. If you wanna go check out my gameplay, it's like 45 minutes of gameplay on my YouTube channel I just uploaded this past week. Devil May Cry 5 gameplay, me playing the demo. I don't know what mission it was. There was a boss fight in, the, in it also. You see me die and fail and all this stuff and do crazy combos. Like, check out that video. My decision, after playing the demo, okay? Because usually they, 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 they Give you demos to, to, to show you, do you like this game or whatever. They probably chose the best level or whatever for us to play. I think I'm going to wait till the game is down to like 30 bucks. And then I'll get it. I think it's worth it that way, okay? I have played all the previous games in the Devil May Cry series. I even watched the anime. And, um... And, uh, I'm an okay fan of Devil May Cry, okay? I'm an okay fan. I'm not, like, a huge fan buying posters and t-shirts and action figures and huge statues on my walls and uh, on, on, on my shelves and stuff like that. But, uh, I will play Devil May Cry, but not, uh, not on day one, okay? But if you want to see me play Devil May Cry, uh, 5, there is a, a, a short video on my YouTube channel. Chris Abbott. 
Will you make more videos on your My Career Player in NBA 2K19? So here's what's going on with NBA 2K19. Every time I live stream the game, it mutes everything. There's no sound whatsoever, okay? So, it's just boring, okay? You guys can't hear the game. Like, during the My Career Mode, there's like cutscenes and conversations and stuff like that. And, um, and... Nah, I'm just gonna experience for myself. You guys have seen me play NBA 2K before. It's not like, you know what I'm saying? A basketball game is a basketball game. And the gameplay doesn't really change. Maybe it's like a little up in the graphics and stuff like that, but that's like it, you know? I do enjoy NBA 2K19, by the way, but, uh, but I'm just like, I, I, I don't really play the game for trophies or achievements anymore. I just like, I, 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 want, I want to fix, you know? So I like turn on like a quick, quick game and then I just play that and I just go go, go to sleep so I, I I don't bother with the you know trying to play through the my career mode and stuff like that uh, I have a little more fun just doing a quick game because you can like adjust all, all the sliders and like you can do a, a three-point from like one end of the, the court to the other and stuff like that okay next question PJ gypsum will you ever eat at Marco's pizza for a video I could have sworn I had a, a I, I don't know what video it was, but I have eaten Marco's Pizza, okay? Uh, if you see my like pizza box collection, Marco's Pizza was there. Um, I think I did record a video of me eating with my, my parents, like a short video. Um, I don't think I ever uploaded that one. But I could have sworn I eat, I've eaten Marco's Pizza before, but it's like in the middle of something else, you know? Uh, like you know, a, a book collection video, they're like, okay, we're done with the collection, let's sit down and eat this pizza. <laughs> Something like that. Um, Miguel P. David, why haven't you played Horizon Zero Dawn? It's dirt cheap nowadays. Yeah, uh, Black Friday was only like a couple, uh, it was like $10. Um, I didn't get it because it's a new game, you know? I'm not connected to those characters and whatever. If I played all the previous games in the, in the Horizon Zero Dawn series, it'd, it'd, it'd be different, you know? So I haven't played Horizon Zero Midnight and Horizon Zero uh, 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 Dusk and stuff like that. Uh, so I have no desire to play Horizon Zero Dawn, you know? Maybe in some in the future, you'll have, a, you know, all seven Horizon Zero Dawns in one big collection for PlayStation 6. Okay, I'll, uh, I'll play that, okay? I have already seen videos of it. Like, I spoiled the entire game for myself. Um, one more, one more question, question, um, X Shadows, yo David, quick question, do you read any Stephen King books? No, if you've checked out some of my, uh, my, uh, book collection videos and library and stuff like that, I don't have any Stephen King books whatsoever, I never read it or, you know, but I have seen, um, uh, uh, movies though, you know, like Shawshank Redemption and, and, um, and uh, I got I, I, the old Pet Cemetery, and uh, and uh, of course I got the It movie, the new the new It movie. I never saw the old one, the one with the with the uh, the dude from from Home Alone two. <laughs> I don't know his name, but uh, but yeah. So th that was th that's it, guys. Oh, you want to know what, what crazy thing? Do you know guys know Eric Bird of the Houston Dynamos? He uh, came to the school that I work at uh, and read to the kids. So. Yeah, so here's a picture of me <laughs> with the kids. So, uh, yeah, uh, that was an interesting thing. I, I, I wasn't expecting that we have a big assembly. And that, like, uh, uh, Houston Dynamo, who's a, a soccer player, uh, he just came back from Guatemala, and he's all injured and stuff like that. And, you know what? Instead of playing for the, you know, practice and stuff like that, I'll just uh, go to some of the local schools and, and read to the kids, you know? So uh, that was cool. Um, Anyway, thank you for watching, everyone. Be sure to rate, comment, favorite, and subscribe. Share the word about my channel. Uh, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.